It's a miracle. Vine has finally been resurrected from the dead. No more RIP Vine. Because guess what? Vine 2 is out. And it's called Bite. Ah! I found out the other day that this new app was going to be released sometime in the spring, but it came as a complete surprise to me when I saw that Dom Hoffman had tweeted out that Byte has officially been released. For those of you who don't know who Dom Hoffman is, he was the co-creator of Vine. The app was originally going to be called V2, but it later on got rebranded to Byte. The beta version of Byte has been available for a while now, but the official release was January 25th in late afternoon to all iOS and Android users. How many of y'all miss making those six second videos? Done. Done. Unlike TikTok where you have to sit through 15 seconds of a video, no one has the attention span for that. Be ready for the wave of people that are about to come over from TikTok and start reposting all their videos to Byte, just to get some clout, you know? You know what I'm saying? Hey, I might do it too. The people that are really gonna love this app are the ones that have been missing the ability to make and share short videos. Byte is going to be TikTok's biggest competition. So I'm gonna show you guys how to use the app. So I want everybody to take out their phone, go to the App Store or Google Play Store and download Byte. Once you download the app, you have two different options. You can either sign in with Apple or you can sign in with Google. I chose to sign in with my Google account. Once you log in, you're then prompted to create your account and create a username. I'm gonna do my first and last name and my last name is just a little bit longer than most. <laughs> now you can go ahead and upload a profile picture and click save and boom. You have five icons located at the bottom of your screen. We're gonna start from the left side and move over to the right. The button furthest to your left is the home button. This is where you're gonna see all the videos of the people that you've followed. Next, you have the search icon. You can search people by their username or the different categories. They have a lot of categories, so I'm gonna list them off really quick. Comedy, animation, chill, pets, art, experimental, weird, gaming, fitness, sports, music, food, style, beauty, screenies, and travel. Woo! So pretty much you have a lot of options to choose from whenever you upload your six second video. Circular icon, this is where you're gonna go if you wanna record your videos. On the bottom left, you'll see those two arrows. Right now it's in rear facing. If you click those arrows, it'll turn to front facing. The arrow with the X is the delete tool. So if you start filming something and then film another clip and realize that you made a mistake, you click that tool and it will take you back to your previous clip. It's really cool because it shows a transparent image of where you stopped last. My hand here, and then wanna move my hand here. And the next button to your right is where you can upload pictures from your camera roll. So for all the people that wanna re-upload all their TikToks, that's where you would go. So the next tool that looks like a lightning bolt is your activity feed. This is where you're gonna see all of the people that like, comment, and follow you. The next tool that has the icon with the hands up in the air, that's gonna be your profile. This is where you're gonna see all of the views, likes, and comments from all of your own personal videos. If you wanna personalize your profile and make it unique to you, click edit profile at the top right. Then you get to choose what color you want your background to be. And you have a wide variety of options to choose from. So who's ready to take a bite out of this app with me? I cannot believe I just did that. I'm gonna try the app out for a while and kind of see how I like it. Then afterwards, I'll upload a video on my thoughts on it. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And might as well just go ahead and follow me on Bite while you're at it. On that note, guys, I'll catch you on the next one.